Hey there, my name is Lynn Nye, future anesthesiologist here with the Stanford AIM Lab at the 2015 Saul Schneider Conference in San Francisco. I'm here with Dr. Wade Chow, private practice anesthesiologist in Hawaii, also on faculty at the University of Hawaii. Dr. Chow, you traveled far to get here today. Yes, and um, I've been attending this conference every other year since regularly um, since 2010. Wow, so what keeps you coming back every time? I think this, is, this conference is very different than the other conferences in that it's totally dedicated to obstetric anesthesia. Whether you are a generalist doing occasional OB anesthesia or a subspecialist in obstetric anesthesia, this conference is totally dedicated to obstetric anesthesia. It gives you the latest information there is on clinical obstetrical anesthesia. Very different than the SOAP annual conference in that it's not as heavily research oriented, but gives you hints, points on how to take care of the obstetric patient. And having worked in private practice, do you feel like you then take away the key points from these conferences back home? Uh, definitely. In private practice, keeping up with the latest can be at times challenging. Hawaii is very geo uh, geographically isolated from the continental U.S. So sometimes getting information that far can take a while. Also, um, when you're isolated from the rest of the continental U.S., you sort of develop a subculture on how to do things. And sometimes changing that culture can be difficult. Coming to a conference like this um, allows you to see how people practice in the uh, rest of the U.S. Do you feel like um, bringing those practices back to Hawaii has been difficult for you, like breaking into the system there? I think at times could be difficult. One of the things I learned from the previous conference was Remy Fentanyl PCA for labor. It took me about 14 months to have the hospital uh, go through with the protocol. Um, of course, there was some resistance from the OB. I had to get in touch with some of the speakers here to help me arrange a lecture that I gave to the OB and to the obstetric anesthesiologist and to the hospital administrators and nursing staff and ultimately went through. And now we have a protocol for patients who cannot get epidurals. Well, sounds like you've established a lengthy career in front of you and I hope to see you back here uh, more in the future. Definitely will. With the Stanford AIM Lab at the Saul Schneider 2015 conference in San Francisco, I'm Lynn Nye, signing off. Thank you.